Hello guys, welcome back to the channel Tree Lover. So if you are new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel and get the latest updates. So as you all know that we are getting back to back ransomware attack on our PC. So I have made a number of videos regarding this ransomware attack. You can go through it and you can just make and data recovery. So here we have a latest ransomware virus and its extension is LQQW. So I have just mentioned this all the data recovery process and this about this virus in this blog also. You can get the website link in the description below. Go through it as you see if you have any language problem then you can just go through it and you can you can recover the data of your pc so we are not wasting our time let's move so first thing i'll tell you how you can remove this orkia file virus from your pc so whenever you have just downloaded something crack on your or you have just tried for the pirated software then you will get this attack and next thing next problem that you can get attack is that if you use the chrome browser and you allow some extension over there ransomware can directly contact you through this medium before you will go for data recovery option you have to remove the viruses from your computer so the best part of your removing the viruses from your computer is just installing a new windows on your pc so if you have no data on c drive then you have to install that new windows on your pc by formatting your laptop using a pen drive so make a bootable pen drive and go through it or else if you are unable to make the bootable pen drive and you do not know any knowledge about the formatting of your pc using the bootable pen drive then you can directly go to the source menu and type as a reset over here so you will see an option reset this pc you will click for it so when you move for it make a backup of that data and just click on the remove everything after choosing this remove everything the pc will be formatted and all these things from c drive will be formatted except the other drive on your pc so other drive will remain as it is so i want to make you clear that there are a lot of spam comment on this ransomware videos so i'll show you an example if you go for this ransomware video then you can find a number of spam comment in this comment section so do not believe this thing they will just ask you to pay some amount of uh, money and just, and they will not recover your file so do not get a scam from this comment so so if you need any support regarding this thing then you can directly contact me through tlover2054 in instagram if you are new to the channel please subscribe to the channel so i'm just telling that after formatting your pc you have to just install a recovery tool on your pc so for recovery tool i have just put that recovery tool in this blog over here you can get this blog link in the description below go through it and check out so after moving this blog you will see a thumbnail on this home page so just click on that ransomware thumbnail and after that you will find a download option just scrolling just below down over here okay so this is the download option just click on this so when you click on this download option you will find this download stellar data recovery download over here you have to use that password as a t lover over here so i've provided this thing over here i have already downloaded this software so let's install this software so here you can find a stellar data recovery install a normal setup over here so it just take a 30 second to install on your pc choose your language if you are from spanish go for spanish france italian or Dutch. so i'm just selecting as english so okay so next again next again next and click on the install so it takes 30 second wait for it So as you see that we have successfully installed our stellar data recovery on our PC. But before going for the launching this stellar data recovery, you have to uncheck this launch item and go for the finish. Okay. So a pop-up will open in your browser, close it and we'll just move for the same installation folder. Okay. So here you will find a crack folder over there. Just go for it. Select the bit of your computer. Either it is 32 bit or 64 bit. You can get this bit from the setting of your pc okay so just i have 64 bit go for it and here you can see a four file over here okay so if you do not get four file just copy this one file and just go back one step back and you will just paste this file over here okay altogether there will be four file over here so you have to copy this four file 
Now minimize this folder and you'll just move for the desktop standard data recovery shortcut. Right click on it and click on the open file location. So after clicking on the open file location, you have to paste this thing over here. So just paste over here. So it will ask you to replace this file. Click on the replace. Do this for all current item and you will just go for the continue. So when this thing will be pasted, your software will be cracked. Okay. So we will open our software. You can just go from here also or you can go from directly from the desktop also so i'm just going from desktop so if your software is not cracked then you will be able to see our demo option on the top bar of your Stellar data recovery tool there is no demo option over here if, if you haven't cracked the software then you will see our demo option over here or you can check this activation over here so if you haven't activate this software then you will be able to see our enter a key on this tab okay first thing you have to do is just uncheck this item okay if you just go for this all data scanning then it might take three to four days for your scan so it is a long time so you cannot make your pc keep turning on for three to four days so just go for one at a time okay so if you need a photo just go for the photos if you need audio go for audios if you need a video go for video or emails folder you can go respective as you need for your document okay so in this video i am just going for photos only so just select your photos and click on the next option so after clicking on the next option you will find a drive of your pc so you have to select the drive where your data is located in this pc i have data on my d drive so i'm just selecting the d drive before going for the scan remember one thing you have to just click on the or enable the dp scan on the left side of your screen so after that just go for the scan option so it might take some minutes just wait for it the scan process depend upon your hard disk storage i'm just skipping this part i'll show you the file after being scanned so before you go for this uh, many people think that this is our data recovery software and it cannot recover your data then i might show you that it's in the official page that ransomware virus recovery service is done by stellar data recovery so it is a strong data recovery tool that you can get your data back so try it by yourself so you can move to the official site also you can see over here you can recover the data from this virus attack also okay so as you see that we have successfully completed our scan over here so after being scan complete you will see a pop-up over here so you have to just close that pop-up and you will just get this all the data in raw folder over here so here is a raw folder i'm just going for it and here is a jpg and png file so i have a file over here so in this way you can get your file or else if you did not get that files in raw folder then you might get in this respective folder also so i have got this file in respective folder also to recover your file you have to just select this item over here from which folder you want data just select it remember you should select raw data always so go for recover and you have to choose a destination over here for example if you are recovering data from D, just select the C drive or if you or you can select this any drive except D drive. Okay, so I'm just selecting as in the desktop. Okay, so in desktop choose any folder and just select for this. So we'll just check out that thing. It is being recovered or not over here. Okay, so I'll just show you. Here I have select that things. So we'll get this item in root folder and here is the last folder. Okay as you see that i have successfully able to recover my pst file also and my image also so if you need any support regarding this thing or you have just confusion to ask with me then you can directly contact me through tlover2054 or else you are not available in instagram then you can choose any method from this site over there so i have just mentioned that you can contact me through facebook twitter or you can directly comment in the youtube section also or you can contact me through whatsapp also so thank you for your support so please subscribe if you are new to the channel and get connected with us so thank you